What's up guys, it's the Doza, and today I am doing the Diamonds Challenge. Now, if you are unfamiliar with what the Diamonds Challenge is, basically, you start a brand new world, you start with nothing, and you have to find diamonds any way necessary as quickly as possible. Now, there's no rules to this. You can do branch mining, you can run through caves, you can find diamonds in an abandoned mine shaft, you can find diamonds in a village. It doesn't matter as long as you're not X-raying or you're not, you don't have, you know, you don't have a world seed that you know where diamonds are already or something like that. No rules. Just find diamonds any way necessary as quickly as possible. Just find one diamond. That's all you got to do. So I'm going to issue this challenge to anybody watching this video, whether you make videos or not. Uh, just post it in the comments below how quick your time was, or make a video response, make a video. And tell and show me how quickly you were able to do this challenge, how quickly you were able to find diamonds. Um, so, like I said, this was this was a challenge issued like a couple years ago. It was pretty popular for a while, and I think the the record was something like a minute or a minute thirty or something crazy like that. I don't think I want to do it that quickly. I've tried this challenge many many times before, just for the fun of it or whatever. And usually it was, you know, five or ten minutes or or longer to even get close to finding diamonds. So. Let's create this world, and I'm going to see how quickly I will be able to find diamonds. Okay, so what's really important, of course, is you want to make a single-player world. I'm going to call it diamonds, but you want to make sure that there's no seed. If you do a video, you want to make sure you're showing that there's no seed, and allow cheats is off, and bonus chests are off, and uh, I prefer to do it in peaceful mode, so I don't have to worry about mobs. You can do it with, with mobs, whatever. So let's create the world. Okay, so I just spawned right here, and I'm next to a tree, fortunately, and I let the world generate a little bit so there's no lag, you know, as far as water spreading and lava spreading and gravel falling and all that stuff. Um, it looks like I have a cave right here as well, so let's get this started. So how this is going to work, I don't have any kind of software that I'm able to put a timer up on the screen or anything, so I'm leaving that up to you guys if you don't trust the time that I have put in the description below or in the annotation somewhere. Uh, you can time me yourself. And you can try this yourself as well. Um, so the time will start right when I hit my inventory button and I get uh, the taking inventory achievement. That's when the time will start. The time will end once the diamond is in my possession. And I think I'll probably get some kind of achievement for mining the diamonds. So the time will start now. Okay, so got a tree right here. Punch this out. All we want to do is get enough wood to get a wooden pickaxe so we can start getting some stone tools. Once we have stone tools... It'll be a lot quicker to get coal, and of course we need the stone tools to be able to uh, mine mine the, uh, the uh, what do you call it, freaking iron, because we will need an iron pickaxe to be able to get the actual diamonds. So that's what's important. So the first race is going to be to get iron. So we'll do this. Looks like we have a cave right here, so I'll be able to get into this cave. And run down. We are in peaceful mode, so we won't have to worry about any mobs. Hopefully, I don't have to worry about dying either. Um, should I waste my time with this? Okay, that's fine. That's quick enough. Let's get some coal right away so we can get some torches because this is going to get pretty dark. I'm not going to be able to cut anything out because I want you guys to get an accurate time as well if you decide to time me. Which I, I hope you guys do. I would love for you guys to time me. I would love to... Uh, have a second, third, fourth opinion on how quickly I've done this. And uh, it might be a lot of awkward talking in this video <laughs> because I can't really cut. Okay, there we go. Now let's make a few stone pickaxes. Just like that. Get everything in order. Put that there. Put that there. I like that. Get some of that. Okay, now let's get some more coal. Now, like I said, the quickest time... I think was like a minute or something really crazy like that. I'm not going to do it in a minute. <laughs> this video will actually probably be close to 10, 15 minutes long. But it's just for fun, you know. Um, I'm going to get diamonds as quickly as possible. This is a proposal to anybody watching. If you, uh, I, I, I would love to see other people do this. I, I want to start this trend again. Uh, I would love to see people try this challenge. I'm going to be posting this on the minecraftforums.net as well uh, just to see if anybody wants to try to do this and try to beat me so this is good we have a cave that goes straight down that's really good that's benefiting me hugely as you can see I spawned in a mesa biome which is kind of crazy uh, looks like bats aren't considered a hostile mob that's interesting I always thought they were 
Okay, so what level are we at here? We are at level 34 here. We're going to want to dig straight down, and we will start at the iron. I only really need, I only need three iron uh, in all actuality, because I only need one pickaxe to be able to get the diamonds. And I just have to make sure that I have plenty of pickaxes to be able to uh, get around. So I'm going to have the F3 screen open just for a minute, just so I can see how long, or where I'm at on the Y level. Oh man, I'm nervous. I'm really, I'm nervous. I feel like every move I'm making is vital, and I feel like some things I'm doing needs to happen a lot quicker. Okay, so we are at 16. Let's get down to level, we'll get down to level 11. I usually like to mine at level 12, but uh, we will do 11, and now I'm just going to start branch mining. So I mentioned in the beginning, there are necessarily, there are necessarily no rules. <laughs> the sentence sounds really strange. There isn't really any any rules as far as this. It's kind of no no holds barred. Whichever, however you want to find diamonds, whether it's a village or it's abandoned mine shaft, you find it in a chest or it's branch mining, or if you want to run through caves, caves might even be quicker. If I found some caves down low, it might even be quicker. Uh, but since we're down here, we are now at level 11. We're at diamond level. I'm just going to do this, do this. Let's uh, get a furnace made so we can get this iron cooking, so we can have this iron all ready uh, to make a pick once we find diamonds. And I'm feeling good about this one. I've tried this challenge a few times, and it is not an easy challenge, that is for sure. It's really stressful <laughs> to be all to be honest. Oh, I drank a bunch of coffee before I did this, and now my, my body temperature is all up. <sighs> I'm stressed, I'm nervous. I just want to complete this challenge. So I probably won't do this very quickly. We're, uh, the raw footage I have now is already at five minutes, um, and I'm sure it's probably shorter or longer than that because I have the intro as well. This is a separate video than my intro. Don't ask me why. That's just how things work. So... A lot of awkward talking, a lot of uh, kind of just my mind blabbering because I need I need to be able to uh, this needs to all be on on video for you guys to be able to get a proper uh, proper time if you don't trust my time and I, I need to get a proper timing too so I know you can't see anything right now and that's also part of it you kind of just have to deal with that oh there we go hit some redstone that lights it up come on diamonds where are you at. This is new, this is 1.7 land, so I'm not sure if uh, diamonds appearing is uh, changed from 1.6, but on our SMP server we're on 1.6. I, I don't think the uh, the rate of diamonds is, has changed at all. Oh, come on. I wish I had some more torches, because this is straining my eyeballs. And probably really, really annoying to watch on your side from YouTube as well, because things get even darker on YouTube. Come on, man. Show me the diamonds. Show me... Give me diamonds or give me death. Don't give me death, because I, I feel like if I die, that's probably an automatic lose. Probably should pop be popping out into the tunnel anytime now. There we go. Oh, man. Okay, so... I feel like this tactic is not working. Let's... Oh, perfect timing for that. Let's get these guys made. So we got three. Uh, well, let's do this. Oh my God! Time! Come on! We got we got no time. Hurry up, Doza. Do this? Huh? Not wood. Do that. Oh, you stupid, stupid. Okay, whatever. We'll use this iron pickaxes because it's a little bit quicker. I don't have any shovels, so I don't want to fuck around with dirt right now. Um, but the iron pickaxe is a little bit quicker, and I wouldn't be using an iron pickaxe right now if I didn't have a few of them made already. I'm surprised I haven't found any ore, really, have I? I haven't found any coal or anything. Well, I guess I've found some redstone and stuff. Um, I tried this challenge a couple times already, and <laughs> I found lots of gold. But uh, I, I kind of tried this just for fun, just just to see what I was up against. So I'm kind of prepared as far as uh, as far as knowing about all this darkness I got to deal with. Oh man, you gotta do you gotta do a couple practice runs. Here's a spoiler alert for you guys if you didn't know. You know when your favorite Minecrafters or your favorite YouTubers play games and they play they play adventure maps and stuff. Well, here's a spoiler: they played the game ahead of time. They played the whole map once before before they even 
recorded it and released any videos on YouTube because they need to know what they're up against. They need to know what's going to be good content. They need to know if the map works correctly. And they need, I mean, it, it, it's pretty much staged. <laughs> like the Yogg's cast, um, people have always said that everything is scripted and it's staged. Well, in a sense, it kind of is because they need to, uh, oh, diamonds, yes. And time, mine, whew. Whew, okay. So I don't know how fast that was. I was just... Okay, let me finish what I was saying about the Yogg's cast first. So, it is scripted in the sense that it is very well prepared ahead of time. It's not necessarily scripted as in word for word, but the series of events and actions that happen are scripted and planned ahead of time. So, there's a spoiler alert for you guys. People take notes for their videos and talk about things. So it kind of is scripted in a way. Uh, so I'm going to stop that rant. So, okay, challenge over. I hope you guys got that timing. I'm going to test it out later. The timing is probably, well, it is, it's in the description. That's the time that I got in editing. Please try it yourself. Post in the comments below in the video or on Minecraft forums, wherever you're watching this at. Tell me how quickly you've done this, and I, I challenge anybody to do it. Anybody and everybody. Specific people I want to tag and I want to I want to challenge. I want to challenge Grutz, Finnowin, and Quantum Matter. Those are the three I know make videos pretty often. So I challenge you guys to make a video on your own. Do this. See how quickly you can find diamonds. Sorry, I was talking with my hands. I wasn't moving around. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, be sure to go check out the uh, my um, SMP videos. Subscribe. Uh, you know, all that fun stuff. Like the video if you did it. Enjoy it. Leave a comment below. Do this challenge. It's a fun challenge. Go ahead and try it. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Love, peace, and chicken grease. Peace the fuck out.